for the Windy City Pace Final. The track announcer there is Tony Salvaro. He'll give us the call of the Windy City Pace. This is the 15th edition, first contested in 1983. It used to be held early in the stake season, now obviously very late. Tony Salvaro with the call. Rough get it the Wes. They're off. On the extreme outside, there goes Gemini Jason winging out for the lead. On the inside of us is Duncan McLeod as their Park Lane Comet. Now they dive into that first turn, and Duncan McLeod now has the early speed Park Lane Comet. His second, Gemini Jason, now looks to drop in third. Down to the outside, there goes Gothic Dream. Another two lengths to the Wiz down to the outside. There goes Arturo, followed by Noble Crusader. Yankee Cam driving by the opening quarter and a lively 27 and 2 that first quarter and it's a battle up front here comes Gothic Dream and Gothic Dream up to challenge Duncan McLeod for the lead two lines back to Park Lane coming who's saving ground now to the outside of horses here comes Gemini Jason driving for the half mile juncture Gothic Dream under urging and Gothic Dream has the lead 55 and 4 the race is half over now they wheel into that clubhouse turn gothic dream maintains a lead now a length and three quarters on the inside duncan mcleod is still right there in second but here comes gemini jason now third now second he's going up after the leader they curve into the black stretch now less than a half mile to pace in the race two now three horses are across the track here comes the Wiz, and the Wiz charges up on the outside to challenge and take command. 125 and 4 for the three quarters. Into the far turn, it's the Wiz. Here comes Arturo, and Arturo moves at him on the outside under urging. They turn for home. It's the Wiz on the inside. Arturo is racing at him. Here they come, down the stretch they go. It's the Wiz with the lead. Arturo is coming on. Here comes Arturo with a rush. It's Arturo on the outside at the wire. Well, it is the millionaire Arturo, owned by Carl Gregg of East Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, who captures the Windy City pace tonight. Arturo, trained by Steve LeBlanc, who had some problems with this horse early in the year, and switched the Pacers' hind shoes from steel to aluminum. And let's see how we did it as we 80 and 260, the Wiz second, 440 and 4, Yankee Camp third, $4 even, the exact at 2180, the over under 1450.